previously on Phillips Fan Bam. Uh, you know why that um, I'm coming with him? Because I'm the boss. Don't ever wanna be like I did that day. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Super Soaker right here, the Sokzuka. We've got the Zombie Strike. <laughs> secret is secret is to take a few hits yes. while you're going in. And we're gonna get ready to light these fireworks. Woo -hoo -hoo. Hey guys, I'm opening up the vlog today. It's like 11 and uh, 11 o'clock and today is actually the day before we go to Brian Head, so we're getting all ready for that But while you when you guys see this vlog, we'll probably be driving up or almost there So right now I'm just gonna show you like what I pretty much did Last night, which I'm pretty proud of myself. I Cleaned my closet out. It looks very nice now It took forever because I've been needing to do it. And I just never did so I was up late last, last night doing it. I went through all my clothes. And then I have tons of stuff packed for tomorrow and this thing. So, and then I cleaned my room. Didn't make my bed. Um, but everything else is clean. So yeah, it's going to be like in, I think, like 50s or something. It's going to be like super cold outside. We are just all getting ready for that. And later today, I think I'm going to be hanging out with a friend. And so right now I'm just cleaning up and doing stuff before I go. And yeah. All right, good morning everybody. What is up, you guys? Today is kind of a busy day. Getting ready for our trip tomorrow. As, as Ashlyn had already told you guys, we're getting ready, packing up, getting the house clean. Not only are we packing clothes and things like that, which I packed all the kids' clothes the other day, which is like, now that it's today, I'm like, hallelujah. I'm so glad that I did that ahead of time because today, literally, just packing my clothes. I packed most of my clothes last night. My clothes, Danny's clothes. Um, and the older kids will pack their own clothes, which I think they're pretty much packed. But we also have to pack some food for the trip because we are in charge of some food nights. And so right now, I have some meat going in the microwave that I am going to brown up because we are doing like a spaghetti night one night. And um, so I'm just gonna brown the meat and put it in the freezer. I was just gonna bring like the rolls of frozen meat, but hello. Inez was like, oh, you should just brown it up or bring it in like a bag, like freeze it in the freezer and put it in a bag. I'm like, uh, yeah, that's way easier. What are you doing? You guys fight every time I get on the camera, you little stinks. Hey, hey, what? Elijah, are you excited for our trip tomorrow, dude? Yes! Are you excited to help me get ready for it? <laughs> Say yes, of course. I love helping my mom. She gave birth to me. Of course I'll help her. <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. So what are you going to help with? I'm putting it on the camera so I can hold you to it. I'm going to help with playing Fortnite. Oh, you know you're going to get a lot of bad comments for that one. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> what are you going to help with? What do you think? At least your chores, right? I'm going to do my chores for sure. For sure. Which are? Uh, make bed, get dressed, dust. Clean my bedroom. Is that it? Empty trash. Empty trash. Like a one. Pick up toys, pick up clothes, yeah. Awesome. I can't wait for you to get started, dude. Yeah, I have to say something else. What? I'm gonna help playing Fortnite. Oh, you wish. I you wish. Know, I don't know yet. No. So when we go on trips, I usually have the kids help me with stuff other than just their regular chores, just because while I'm packing and getting things ready, I need help with like the cleaning part of everything. So I sent Brayden a list um, of things that he needs to get done. I think a list for Ashlyn of things that she needs to get done. And then these little ones are gonna help with whatever I need help Guys, with. Me and dad are gonna do a kitchen the kitchen today. Yeah, which I don't know when that will be up. If it'll be up before this or after it'll this, probably but. Be Maybe tomorrow or then or on Saturday. Or it will already be up. We're not sure. We're not sure yet. Yeah. So because here's the thing. We aren't sure because we're staying up in the mountains in a cabin. We are not sure how the Wi-Fi is going to be up there or if we're going to be able to even upload our vlogs up there. So what we're trying to do is trying to stash some videos and schedule them to go up just in case 
we can't get them up when we're up there. So you guys might be getting a cook with me. I think you guys are going to be getting a haul. So you guys stay tuned for that. We'll keep you guys updated, hopefully via Instagram or via the community tab here on YouTube as far as what we're going to be doing with the videos because we really won't know until we get up there what the connection is like and things like that. We'll take you through today. Get ready, get packed, get things going. Oh, I got the car cleaned out yesterday too. Hallelujah! Like I feel like I'm ahead of schedule so I'm not totally, totally stressed today, which is nice. All right, you guys, so we're gonna be um, hiking, of course. We're in the mountains, we have to be hiking, although it might be raining, you guys. It says thunderstorms, which means there's usually rain, but I just wanted to show you guys what I did. I have two hiking backpacks in this little bag here, and then all of the kids' hiking shoes, boom right there at the bottom. So I didn't have to worry about putting that in their suitcase with all of their clean clothes. This just kind of worked out perfect. So we'll put all that stuff in there and then I'll show you what else we're gonna be doing. Guys, and I'm also gonna help with the floor. Yes, we're Elijah. Paper towel, spray, spray, spray. Yeah, I have the squirting mop now. Yes. Yeah, so Elijah has gotten really good at helping with cleaning the floors. He literally gets on his hands and knees squirts the squirt and mop and wipes it up and it ends up looking really good huh bud yeah i have to get all the blocks but last time he did it he's like oh i'm oh so God, tired it's very tiring because i did all of this and then i skipped and then i did some of this and then i skipped all the way over here i did all of that part and i did this part and i'm like i give up <laughs> He's like, I'm over it. So you excited to do it all over again? Not really. <laughs> I am, but I'm not. Yeah. Because it's tiring and exhausting. It is tiring and exhausting, but it helps me out. All right, just getting the meat ready for this weekend. Got it all defrosted. Now I'm just gonna cook it up, put it, put it in a Ziploc bag, and then stick it in the freezer. Meat. What? <laughs> Brayden's chanting for the meat. <laughs> We're gonna get this going, get this all browned up, get this in the freezer, get everything else we need to do done. We've got Elijah here getting ready to do the floors, do his room, do his chores. I need the strawberries. He thinks he needs strawberries before he gets it all done. All right, got the meat done, hallelujah. We got Ethan dancing, hallelujah, yeah. We got Brayden doing dishes, we got Elijah dancing. We're having a good old time. Whoa, we got some break dancing going on. Oh, shoot. You guys could just use your bodies to mop the floor if you want. That could work too. I'm just gonna make it dirty. Ashlyn's gonna go get her nails done right now because she has been killing it with helping me. She is always my biggest helper. Woo! Honestly, I'm tired of this. Oh, yeah? Yeah? Oh, man. What did you do today to help, dude? I got six children to put my game. Oh, yeah, that's what I thought. Anyways, every time we go on a trip, this girl's my lifesaver. She helps me with so much. All right, you guys, so I just wanted to show you guys what I have going on up here. This is my suitcase with all my stuff. I totally overpacked because that's just what I do. I like to have options. So yeah, I've got tons of shirts in here. I've got short sleeve, long sleeve. I got my sweatshirts, um, jackets. I have Danny's shoes in here. Um, I have my shoes in here, pajamas, different things, leggings that I will need, socks up there, underwear up there, undershirts up there. This will be Danny's suitcase. I don't always know what to pack for him, but I do try to set things aside for him so he can kind of pick from things. So I got some thermals here since, like, as you guys know, it's gonna be cold. And I got some sweatshirts, some pants, some warm-up jeans, his underwear, shirts here that he can kind of pick through, see what he wants, what he doesn't want. We'll exchange it however he needs it. But he has been working so hard at work. He's had a ton of jobs. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but he has started his business here in Las Vegas. So he has been a lot more busy than normal. So he's gone a lot now. He's been out at the job all day today. He's had a few estimates today. So he's out and about. So I'm trying to get as much of this done as I can while he's out because I would hate for him to have to come home and do a million things when he's home when he already has to edit and do all these other things. So I'm trying to get what I can out of his um, to help get him a little bit packed. I know he's probably not gonna want all the stuff I pulled for him, but he will, it's, it's a good start. That's what we have going on with the packing. I've got, like I said, all of the kids all packed up. If you guys didn't see that video where I packed up their suitcase, I will have Danny link it um, up above so that you guys can go watch that. But otherwise, we're just doing cleaning. Danny and I are gonna go grocery shopping for the stuff for the cabin. 
and um, really I'm almost done. It actually feels kind of nice. Almost done. We're leaving early tomorrow morning to head out there. We are so, so excited. Can't wait. Can't wait to take you guys with us, show you guys what it looks like up there in the mountains, and um, yeah, just experience it. It's our first time there, so we are super, super excited. Hey, what's up? So we are home. We just got back from Winco, you guys. We are gonna be filming a haul, a haul in a moment. That will be up tomorrow. So stay tuned though, because coming up right now, Elijah, Ethan, and I are going to be what? We're gonna be making tater tot waffles. Tater tot waffles, you guys. First time ever making them, huh? Uh -huh. You're I excited. Yeah. That's gonna be so fun. Emberlyn's gonna be our official taste tester of the tater tot waffles while she's eating her sugar daddy. No candy! Oh my mama. I had some gum. That's why we went to Winco, so we hit the candy bins, right? You guys, check this out. This is a, this is a little sneak peek into the grocery haul that you guys will be seeing tomorrow. Boom, bam. That's it, you guys. Stay tuned for tomorrow. It's gonna be an awesome one. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be ready? everything you ever dreamed of. Are you ready to, to get this uh, all going. So if, if they see you wearing the same clothes in the hall you that you're know. wearing in this vlog, it's because we're filming everything on the same day. Yes. <laughs> I took this out to tell you that, but Danny told you for me. So. What? That that's why I'm wearing the same clothes, yeah. literally. Yeah, and I've been packing all day, so it's like, and I'm sweaty mess. It's like what? It's like. <laughs> nice. It is so hot outside. 114, you guys. Like, we could not be leaving to go to the mountains at a better time because Seriously. it's like. I think it's like 60, between 40 and 60 up in the mountains this week. So, so nice. It's gonna feel so good. All right, you guys, so we just finished up the haul that you will be seeing tomorrow. Winco haul, our Winco vacation haul. You guys will be seeing tomorrow. But right now, Tina is gathering all of the food up for the road trip that we start on tomorrow also. Just getting all the food like in bins, like trying to get all the like dry food. So I have like that whole bin right there is full of like our canned food, all sorts of different stuff. So you guys will see in the hall like everything we got, but I'm just trying to like figure out the best way to pack it all up so it will fit in our car and make it all the way up there. As soon as she's done getting that all organized, the boys, Ethan and Elijah, and myself, we are going to be making some, they're like tater tot waffles, kind of like tater tot grilled cheese with egg and bacon and just, just everything good, dude. Are you ready? In the meantime, you're having some candy. That's awesome, with a Zevia, so you're good. Elijah, you ready for this, dude? I'm so hungry. Same. Yeah? And Elijah was in the hall, you guys, right? He made an appearance. Yes, I did. Are you are. Oh, hey, get off the get off the rug carpet. Good, you tell him. Good boy, Jasper. Good boy. You know we're leaving. All right, so I'm gonna see if Tina needs any help, and then I am gonna get ready to eat. I am so hungry, you guys. <laughs> Do you even want to try one of these? I totally want to try it. I really? feel like it sounds so good. Yeah. I totally do because I love tater tots and I love cheese and I love bacon. So <laughs> it all sounds delicious to me. Check this out, you guys. You guys, I seriously, I got this bag at Target and I freaking love it. It fits so much. Like you feel like it doesn't fit that much. Look at what's in here. Two boxes of cereal and one, two, three, four, five party size chips and I could probably fit this in here too. Oh. And zip it up. Like no joke. Boom. Wow. Look at this. Look. And if you remember, this was the bag I used to pack the kids that one like short trip we went on. I was able to pack all three kids clothes in this bag. We'll so, link this in our description below you yeah, guys. I got it from Target and it seriously it has been like awesome. It like fits our beach towel. Like it's awesome. So yeah, I just fit all of that in this one bag. So, so awesome. <laughs> Boom, all right boys, so what are, we, what are we gonna make? We're gonna make tater tot waffle, bacon, eggs, and cheese. 
Awesome, so it's almost like a breakfast grilled cheese sandwich with eggs and bacon. Are you ready, dude? Yep. Ethan's gonna, what, you gonna get some of the eggs going? Should we yep. do some scrambled and some over easy? Yeah. Yeah, we'll do both. Mostly over easy? Yeah, I love that. Well, you, you'll get started on the bacon, right? Yes, I'll get started on the bacon. All right, E's gonna go ahead and get started on the eggs. We're just gonna crack some eggs. Boom. It's gonna get some bacon. He's gonna put some strips on. We've, on right now. No, put the bacon. So we've got the oven preheating at 350 for the bacon. Okay. Once we get the bacon kind of cooked up a little bit, we will, um, we'll start heating up the waffle iron. Ethan's got the eggs going. Awesome, way to think ahead, boy. If you haven't already seen um, our, some of my other waffle cook with me's, go ahead and check it out. We'll go ahead and link it right up here. And so, we've done like, what do we've done? Like chocolate waffles, we've done. Didn't I like, make one of them? Oh, yeah, hash brown waffles. we did another type of hash brown waffles. Quite a few waffles, you guys. I'll make a playlist and I'll send it here. Go check them out. But this one, we are really excited for. All right, so Elijah's done with the bacon, washed his hands. Now you can go ahead and take it and let's put it in the oven, dude. Isn't it the best when you like bite into like a breakfast sandwich and then the yolk just like pops? Oh, that's, oh. <laughs> Making my tongue water. Oh. Elijah's getting all the tater tots out. Not all of them. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the tater tots kind of around here and then we're gonna make it into a waffle. We're gonna do a top and a bottom. <laughs> so what's your like, so what's your like favorite all time breakfast? That's a hard one. Probably, hmm. I don't know it's one of them that you guys made. What was it? Was it like a breakfast bagel or was it like a? It was like a sandwich. Oh. It was like a waffle, waffle. Like about the breakfast pizza. Oh, Ethan made the breakfast pizza, right? Or did you? I did. Oh, that was awesome. That was good. We also made the um. Barbecue pizza. The yeah. French toast wrapped sausage. We made those. Mm. There's a lot of good ones, man. My I love breakfast sandwiches, though. My favorite would probably be the probably be the hash brown waffles. Those were delicious. Yeah, so we're gonna make something pretty similar to them right now. All right, Elijah's gonna go ahead and start putting on the hash the tater tots. Boom, dude. Now put it down. Oh, Slowly. so good. Look at this, guys. Oh, my. Yeah. Okay, guys. So that sign right there, it says ready with a little light on top. So when that turns green, that means it's all ready. But sometimes it could do it a little bit earlier because we don't tend to get too burnt. But most of the time, we listen to the light. So here we go. Boom. Ready. Oh. Look at that. Okay guys, we know the light said ready, but we don't think it's ready enough, like cooked enough. So we're just gonna wait a little bit longer and let it crisp up a little bit, yeah. Let it crisp up because we love like crispy like stuff. Like I like crispy tater tots. Like, yes. Like right when you bite into it, oh my gosh, it feels so good. And we're gonna get some bacon and cheese. And Ethan's over here doing an awesome job on the eggs. He's got some scrambled eggs cooking up over here. Yeah, boy? Yeah. He was like, oh wow, I can make scrambled eggs. <laughs> Cause I only knew how to make over easy. Yeah, dude, great job. So our first round, the waffle, the tater tots didn't hold up, but oh they my goodness. Browns, yeah, they but they are so, so good. serious. So we've got another one in there. We think we're learning. 
We're kind of adjusting as we go. We're trying to figure ways out to make them stick together. Yeah, but so Ethan's we... totally bomb over here with these eggs. Oh my goodness. All right, so we are trying to get this going. We're having a little difficulty getting them to stick, but honestly, you guys, oh, oh my so gosh, good. they're so good. And I think you have to, the hotter you get them, the better they'll stick because they're not moist inside. What I'm seeing is some of them are kind of moist inside and um, they're not sticking as well. But when you get them like real crispy, they stick together. It's so good. Okay guys, this one it turned out a lot more better than our last one. Because this one actually looks like a hand of a tater tunnel waffle. Oh my gosh. And then dad is starting on a new one right here. Okay guys, so now dad's starting on a new one. And we're making like a hash brown waffle sandwich for us. And we're gonna be delicious. And um, we're gonna cook this one even longer so it can be nice and crispy and crunchy and we're, real we're realizing that it has to be like very hot, very crisp to hold together. Oh my gosh, guys. I stinking can't wait for these. What are they called? Oh yeah. Tater top waffles, I can't wait. Oh my gosh. Boom, so now we're getting this. This is gonna be the top. We're waiting for that to heat up and then we're gonna put the bacon on top of it with some egg and cheese and we're gonna make the sandwich, dude. Are you ready? Yes. All right, check this out. Look at this awesome handshake. Oh. <laughs> That's called the booty slap. <laughs> It smells amazing and delicious Ooh, in here. We're trying to get this to work. We're trying to get it so it doesn't fall apart because if we can get it to not, well actually, this one we're not getting to fall apart yet. So, what we're gonna do here, real quick, is we're gonna take bacon. No way. Put it on, let's get two slices, okay? You guys, this smells amazing. Put your hands. Boom, okay. Then, what we're uh -oh. gonna do, this one will be Elijah's. He doesn't want any egg. Then we're going to put some cheese on. Oh, cheese it up, it, up, up, it cheese sit, it up. And then so letting it, it sit. So then. Are you seriously sandwiching that thing? Then what we're gonna do. Oh no. Is sandwich it. Oh like my, is it gonna and, shut? No, and then we let it, then we let it. Um, just oh, like melt it. <laughs> that looks amazing. Yes. Hear that sizzle. Oh my gosh. Oh no, you didn't. That's a so hefty. it is, I'll be honest, it is hard to get it all off in one piece. You've got to like really cook the tater tots so they're crisp and then I almost like let it cool off a little so they harden a little and then and then try to get it off. But if you can get it off without breaking, you guys, this is an, gonna be an amazing sandwich. Just oh, man. Oh, bacon and cheese. Boom. So, all right, you guys, here we go. We tried cutting it, and honestly, it just didn't work, so we're just gonna eat it, right? So we're gonna kinda split it up, and then we're just gonna eat it, put some eggs with it, some syrup, just have it our own way, and we'll try another one, maybe another day. Boom, here we go. Elijah wants to take, do a little taste test. Did you put syrup with it? Uh huh. Oh, nice. How is it, dude? Favorite waffle, because it's the new kitchen ever. Really? Mm -hmm. It's like so crunchy, salty. Mm. So good. With the syrup, it's awesome. I need to try it with the bacon. Let's go, E. What are you saying? I should put the syrup on and I'm good. I don't want any syrup on mine. No? So I guess I'm gonna try mine even on the bacon. Ooh. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Is that good or what? Mm-hmm. Very good. Guys, I'm yeah. trying nice. It with the cheese. I'm trying it with the cheese and bacon now. Dude, you guys just made this. Good job. Mm. Ethan, what are you doing, dude? I need to get everything. Here it is. Syrup, egg, hash brown. Oh my gosh. And, and over easy egg. Oh my cheese. gosh. Oh, 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 that looks so good, buddy. 
How's it taste, dude? So good. Dang, that's all you. That's all you boys. Mm -hmm. Good, MZ? Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at this, you guys. It's like pivot. Oh. If I close my eyes and think about us, I can see the person I know I should be. Cause honestly, I don't have no time to waste. I'm trying to come back to you because now I see we were meant to be. Okay, guys, so right now we're. Uh, Ending the vlog. We're closing it out because it is bedtime and we have an early morning tomorrow. We're gonna head out, have a great time. And we're, we are going to meet some friends at a cabin and it's gonna be how much? Like hours for the drive? It's like three and a half hour drive, so that's not too bad. Not too bad. And we also have some snacks. We had a list, list and we went to Winco. Oh, and we got the snacks for um for the trip. cabin yeah for the cabin and and we also got some candy me and ethan yeah we pretty much have everything packed up ready <laughs> to go and now we just have to wake up early get the last minute things in the cooler and then boom head out yeah and um ethan elijah and dad they uh, made some tater tot waffles. They were amazing. They were so good, huh? Uh -huh. I like it with the bacon and the eggs. Yeah, they were delicious. And guys, um, when I tried the little the non scrambled over easy eggs, um, I actually really liked it. And I kind of like scrambled. It's all right, but I'll still have it. But I still kind of like the other eggs. Though. Yeah. I like the other two. I like the over easy. Let us know down below. What do you prefer? Scrambled eggs or over easy eggs? Yeah. Or hard boiled eggs. What do you prefer? And guys, if you guys should make the tater tot waffles. And if you do, tell us if you guys liked it or if you guys didn't really like it. Yes, that would be awesome. All right, you guys. So that's it for now. Amberlyn is into her show. So <laughs> we are going to go and we'll see you guys tomorrow and choose your day bye bye, bye, -bye. <laughs>